Hello, this is my book, The False Prince by Jennifer A. Nielsen. And so it all starts in Kingdom long ago, and this boy named Sage runs away from his family in Avignon. And he goes to Carcia, and he goes to an orphanage and pretends to be a son of a duke that doesn't want to be a duke. And he somehow gets mixed up in this plot that involves the queen and the king's lost son, Jerem. And he got lost in a ship that was attacked to, at, that was attacked by pirates. And so he gets mixed up in this thing. And so you have to choose to lie or choose to die. And it all happened one day when he stole some meat from a butcher. And the butcher is running at him with his knife. And he's like, stop, stop now. And he almost made it back to the orphanage where he was going to escape. But this guy tricks him. And so he falls on the ground right on his right shoulder. And so the butcher starts kicking him. And this man comes up behind the butcher. And you find out later his name is Connor. And so Connor, he says, how much was that meat? And he, the butcher says, 30 garlands, which was the money they used back then. And so he's like, I'll pay you 80 garlands for the boy and the meat. And so he says, the, yes, and the butcher yells at Sage, the boy's name, and kicks him again. And so Sage doesn't want to get up because he's like hurting real badly. And Connor, the guy, makes him get up and has a really interesting talk with the orphanage's owner. And she only keeps him there because he steals for her. And so he's running out of the place because Connor's asking him questions and he thinks he's gonna become a servant. So he starts to run out of the orphanage and gets out of the door, and two people were waiting out of them. One clubbed him in the head, and one took his hands behind his back, and right before he blacked out, he just baptized the person and let him go. So read The False Prince by Jennifer E. Nielsen.